Greetings, my name is Floyd Christofferson. Today I'm going to give you a quick overview of the new Hammerspace Metadata plugin and how Windows users now have global control of their data no matter where it is stored and directly from within their existing PC applications. As you may have learned from other videos, Hammerspace is a software solution designed to help organizations overcome the problems of managing incompatible data silos. Hammerspace does this by enabling users to create a global data environment with a high-performance parallel global file system that unifies multiple storage types from any vendor across any location, including one or more clouds. This enables users uninterrupted file access globally, regardless of which storage platform their data is on today or moves to in the future. In the same way that users get universal access across silos, this also means that third-party applications can easily bridge those silos and locations as well. The key to pulling all this together is the shared global file metadata that Hammerspace assimilates from existing storage. This metadata includes multiple sources of critical information about the files and the storage they live on. In addition, Hammerspace can also include custom metadata, which provides rich contextual information about the files. In this video, we cover powerful new features that tie Hammerspace directly into user workflow. First, there is the Hammerspace metadata plugin, which opens the power of custom metadata tagging directly to users. Plus, we enable users access to previous file versions for protection and recovery directly from their existing desktop applications. With the new Hammerspace metadata plugin, now even non-technical users can easily apply custom metadata labels directly from within Windows. With a simple right click of a file or folder, users can select from a drop-down list of existing metadata labels or create their own. Let's see it in action. To add custom metadata, a user right clicks on the folder and opens the Hammerspace plugin directly from within Windows. Here we apply a label called marketing to associate everything in this directory to the marketing department. Once this has been added, the custom metadata label will be applied to any existing or new files from this folder level on down. If a user creates a new file in that folder, it will automatically inherit that marketing label. They don't need to remember to add it. Here we verify that the metadata was automatically applied to that file without user action. The same applies for new subfolders and files farther down the directory hierarchy. So why is this even important and what problem does it solve? We've already discussed the problems of data sprawl, where even smaller environments grow to include remote locations or the cloud. The larger the environment, the more distributed the use cases, then the more data copies proliferate. The problem is that for both users and IT professionals, keeping track of the data becomes very difficult. When data is shared across different projects, departments, and cost centers, each of which may have different performance requirements, it becomes extremely difficult to keep track of where different data sets should be and even how to allocate costs for different classes of storage as the data moves across different storage silos and locations. This often leads to problems of data gravity, or alternatively, to unnecessary copy sprawl and fragmentation. All of these add cost to both infrastructure and OPEX, and certainly impact user accessibility. The power of Hammerspace is that its parallel global file system spans all storage silos and locations, so all users and applications are sharing the same global file metadata, creating a global data environment. This is where the importance of custom tags and labels with automatic metadata inheritance changes the game entirely. As we've seen, this feature means that files can now be automatically associated with a department, or a project, or cost center, or whatever business metric is needed, without automatic inheritance, this would rely on everyone to always remember to tag their files manually and to do so correctly. Unless a data owner can be confident that every file in every data set has been accurately classified, they cannot have confidence that any of it has been. By ensuring that such business information can be applied to files consistently and reliably, and most importantly, automatically, now businesses can take a data-centric approach to managing their digital assets. These metadata labels 
labels are persistent, following the files wherever they go, whether it is to another site, or to the cloud, or simply to a different storage type. With automatic custom metadata inheritance, data owners can assign business rules with any combination of these variables to align data to its current value. Admins and business owners can track utilization across tiers and silos, and workflows can be automated, staging files from Project A, for example, to the correct storage or locations when needed. And because the system always knows where all files are for any given department or project, it becomes easy to track cost allocations, and intelligent service-level objectives can be set at a file granular level based upon business value to ensure compliance and data protection, as well as data tiering, migration, and other needs. No one ever needs to wonder whether the data that is filling up storage resources is where it should be. A second key feature that we'll talk about today is a capability that enables customers to immediately restore previous versions of their files to recover from accidental or malicious errors and without needing to bother IT staff. The example in this video shows how this works with Microsoft Office files, but this is just part of a much broader undelete and versioning capability within Hammerspace that can be applied across any file on any storage type. Let's see this in action on a Microsoft Word file. Here, a user opens a Microsoft Word file on their PC. To demonstrate the file version restore capability, we'll watch this user add some content to the file, and then save the file, and add some more content and save again. Each time the user saves Microsoft Office files, a new version is created and protected. This works similarly with many applications that create temp files when they save. Other file types are also versioned, but with a different method. In this example, the user has made four edits and saved four times. To restore a previous version, the user right-clicks on the file and opens the Restore Previous Versions dialog, which is part of Windows. After selecting the file, the user simply hits Restore, and the previous version is restored, which then can be saved out as a new file or whatever is desired. It is as simple as that. As we have seen, Hammerspace not only simplifies global management of data and storage resources for IT administrators, but now, with increasing integration with third-party applications, users are able to not only have global online access to all of their data, no matter where it is, but now have even greater self-service control over their files without needing to bother IT staff. In this way, Hammerspace is the missing link that provides customer value for multi-vendor storage and data environments beyond any point solution on the market. Please look for other videos in this series and visit hammerspace.com for more information. Thank you for your attention.